Hey there, experiencing issues with your TP-Link device suddenly rebooting out of nowhere? Don't worry, we've got you covered. This week, we're diving into how to fix TP-Link auto restart issues so your internet connection stays stable and reliable. Whether it's your router dropping out during crucial work calls or interrupting your streaming sessions, these solutions will help get your TP-Link device back on track and ensure smooth sailing in the digital world. Step one, check your power supply. One common cause of auto restarting is an inconsistent power supply. First, make sure your TP-Link device is connected to a reliable power source. Check for any loose connections or faulty power outlets. You might also try using a different power adapter, ensuring it's the correct one for your model. Uninterrupted power supply is crucial for stability, so consider using a surge protector to prevent power spikes that might affect your device. Step 2. Update firmware. Outdated firmware can sometimes cause auto restart issues. To fix this, log into your TP-Link management console by entering the device's IP address in your web browser. Navigate to the firmware upgrade section and check for any available updates. Follow the instructions to download and install the latest firmware. Up-to-date firmware can resolve bugs and improve performance, potentially fixing the auto restart problem. Step three, reset to factory settings. If updating firmware doesn't work, resetting your TP-Link device to factory settings might help. Locate the reset button, usually a small pinhole on the back of the device. Press and hold this button for about 10 seconds until the lights on the front start flashing. This reset will erase all your custom settings, so you'll need to reconfigure your network after. While this step is more drastic, it can solve persistent issues by restoring the device to its original state. Step four, avoid overheating. Overheating can be a stealthy culprit in causing unexpected reboot. Ensure your TP-Link device is in a well-ventilated area, not obstructed by books, furniture, or other electronics that might generate heat. Clean off any dust from the vents, as dust accumulation can block airflow. You can also move the device to a cooler location if overheating persists. This simple yet effective step can keep your device running smoothly and prevent future restarts prompted by high temperature. Step five, monitor network traffic. Sometimes heavy network traffic can stress the device, leading to auto restarts. Use your TP-Link software to monitor network activity. Identify if certain devices or applications are causing excessive traffic. Setting up quality of service features can help prioritize important traffic and manage bandwidth, reducing the chance of overload-induced restart. Fixing TP-Link auto restart issues doesn't have to be a daunting task. By checking your power supply, updating firmware, resetting to factory settings, avoiding overheating, and monitoring network traffic, you can keep your device running smoothly. These practical and straightforward steps ensure your connection remains stable, allowing you to focus on what matters most without interruption. Say goodbye to unexpected reboots and enjoy a seamless internet experience. With these strategies at your disposal, understanding how to fix TP-Link auto restart problems becomes easier, empowering you with the knowledge to tackle common connectivity issues efficiently. Remember to keep your device in optimal condition, enjoy stable surfing, and keep on streaming with confidence.